What's going on guys, Team Mart here. Welcome back to another episode of Need for Speed. What is this right here? Is this an empty spot in our garage? What on earth could we be going with? Holy cow, Kins Unicorn Ford Mustang 1965. Let's go boys. So in the last episode, if you guys missed it, we actually beat Kim Block at a, uh, at a Hoon, at a uh, Gymkhana Hoon. And uh, we got to get his car now. Like, we, we, we have to drive it, right? Like, I, I feel like we absolutely have to. And if you guys remember, Robin's, like, drift train mission, whatever it is, was giving us a ton of trouble. Now, if you could think of one car in the world to be good at drifting, what would it be? This hooning car of Ken Blocks. Like, uh, that's what it specializes in. So, hopefully, fingers crossed, this is going to allow us to beat Robin's stupid mission that she has for us today. I don't know how it's gonna work out, but I'm excited to check this car out. 1965 Ford Mustang. And uh, man, look at that, dude. That is so sick. Listen to that bad boy. Oh, dude, this thing's so loose. Oh my gosh, of course we're beating it in this. Are you kidding me? We're gonna go straight to it. So I was talking about how I didn't think I was ever gonna race this race again because it was so infuriating. I'm gonna turn the fan on real quick because I'm pretty, I'm pretty hot. Anyway, so I was talking about how I didn't think I was gonna be able to do this race because it was so infuriating. I literally like, the, the video messed up but I spent like 45 minutes like trying to beat this race and I couldn't do it because it's not about how well you do, it's about how well the other people do and, and like if you go too fast then you don't get score if you go too slow you don't get score it's just it's super Great tough crowd, so right? this hopefully this hoonigan car is gonna gonna help us out a little bit see what i mean though you need to like you need to be slow you need 43,000. but the deal is is this thing's it's so good at drifting we don't really need like a big build up like a lot of other cars do This might be a frustrating episode, guys. We're off to a pretty rough start. I, we're gonna we're gonna restart this. We need a little bit better start than that if we're gonna be able to beat this. But yeah, you guys can see that like obviously right there I was going way too fast. I really wasn't even going fast. I was sitting off the gas for half the time, yet it was still too fast. Now, if I go any slower than that, they're gonna end up blowing by me and I can't even catch up with them. So that's why I'm so insanely frustrated with this race. So we'll just sit back and get some points like that. Why not? This thing's so fast, it's almost hard to control. Oh, wow, dudes. We just got half of what we need right there. About. Oh my gosh, dude. I'll let her get in front of me because I don't want to go too fast. Come on, Robin, go! Why are you driving so slow? All right. We got to hit it here at the end. Got it, boys. Let's go. Oh my gosh. I'm so happy. I'm s this car made it too easy. I'm so happy. This is so hard to do in a normal car. This doesn't really give it justice because I made that look so easy. Or this car. It wasn't even me. It was the car that made it look that easy. But you guys can see if you get just like five car lengths ahead, it says that you're f too far away to earn points. But I don't care because we already won. Wow. 
Wow, we doubled it, dude. I was hating my life when it came to this race, and we just got it without a problem. Ken Block, thank you, bro. Thank you. Thank you. Oh, that just... Let out a sigh of relief, boys. All right, here we go. Let's see what's gonna be next. Robin's giving me a call. Dude, that was insane. I'm hitting up All right, girl, I'm down for that. Looks like we're over here. Ready, set, trip. It's another medium race. So this is like the one that we're super far behind on. With Manu, we beat that in the last episode. We beat uh, Spike in the speed uh, the episode before that. Uh, Robin were, or not, Robin were really far behind. Amy were pretty close. I think we're only a couple of races off from being able to get to the end of it, but uh, Robin, we've got some work to do. So that's what we're going to focus on in this episode since we did unlock... Um, oh, it's another drift train. Shoot. Since we did unlock Ken's car, we, we might as well focus on the drifting, right? That only makes sense. When it's a drift train where there's only two of you, it's a little bit easier to manage. But the fact that it was three last time was what really made it difficult. Robin, you race like a dingleberry. Has anybody ever told you that? Just completely sideways. No worries in the world. Right, we beat it. Whatever. I'm dusting you, girl. I'm sorry. You literally, you pissed me off to no end. You're kind of hot, but you pissed me off. Show me any hot girl in the world, and I'll show you a guy that's sick of her crap, and that's exactly the story with you. <laughs> Just straight up coming at her life right now, but she's... She's annoying, dude. And she was fangirling over Kim Block in the last episode. I don't appreciate that. Not in front of me. Say goodbye to what's, what we once had, Robin. No, but seriously, I just don't like waiting around for your ass. These trip things. Gosh, this car. It's faster when it gets going sideways, I feel like. This is insane. And that's it, boys. <laughs> Done. Easy peasy lemon squeezy. I will take that all day. All right, we're going to take that. We're going to roll with it. Hopefully, she's going to call us again and have another thing. Another mission. All right. That was sick. I'll be at the lock up. See you there. Right, let's go meet her down at the lock up. So it's over by that uh, shipping facility. We've done a couple of races with her over here, so we'll see what she's got going on. I'm gonna put some chapstick on. I have a mouth guard that I wear like for my teeth because these teeth are fake and I grind my teeth, so it's really bad for fake teeth. The mouth guard I wear at night to keep me from grinding and, and hurting them, but it makes me keep my mouth open so my lips get super chapped overnight because I'm like breathing air in and out on them the whole time. <laughs> Just run into the wall, no big deal. Nice Check TV out. channel, girl. Gotta see this. this right here is what we're trying to achieve. Nice internet, girl. Man, what's wrong with this thing? Whatever. So check it. Cook's out front of the pack. We're all behind him, fishtailing, squealing, whatever, doing our thing. Out of nowhere, AJ squeals past like a G. We jump on the I-5, AJ clips the divider, and just gets away with it. Now we're eight cars deep busting this insane train at freeway speed. What the hell, Robs? I thought we were meeting up. Yeah, I'm meeting up here. Oh, man, you ran away to join the circus too, huh? <laughs> Travis and you? Uh, no, no, I was uh, I was maxing at the diner, and I caught this hype, some asshat train on the freeway. Guess my invite got lost. Yeah. Didn't think it was your scene. It ain't. <sighs> well, you keep it real classy. Yeah, I'm out. You just. You taste that salt? There's salt in the air. It's just jelly. So anyway, next, you and I gotta work on getting our train up to freeway speeds like these. 
let's see if we can get you some risky devil style. Well, maybe if you could keep up, we could do that. But... What do I know? Oh, dude, this car is so sick. The monster logos are like tiger stripes and stuff. Woo. It is one sexy car. All right. I'm waiting for Robin to call me. Dude, I think this has to be the best car in the game. It makes drifting in corners so easy. I guess she's not gonna call yet, so I'm gonna go ahead and go up to Amy and see what she has here. Sprint race, race the finish line in a point-to-point -point sprint race. First one across the finish line wins. Let's do it, boys. All right, so we're starting to progress farther along with Robin. We're almost towards the end with Amy, and then we have the outlaw guy where we have to outrun cops and stuff like that. It's been a good one so far. Win the events with Amy. So obviously this car isn't going to be the best in the world for a sprint race, unless we're going to have a lot of turns. But uh, I think we can do it. Did I spawn out front of everybody? That's weird. It's just, this car is insane, bro. It's like it's, it's on ice. It's honestly almost even hard to control. Like when you're trying to go on high speeds like this, it's kind of hard to control. You guys can see I'm kind of all over the road. It's great for drifting when you're going a little bit slower and you want to rack up points and do that kind of thing. But trying to just go in a straight line, it's pretty difficult. It's kind of sexy how she calls me and says, hey you. What's up, girl? <laughs> this is going to be a tough one to win, boys. I think we can do it, though. We're lucky we're in hilly country. In curvy country. This guy in second place really wants our... Bologna sandwich, though. I'm honestly really surprised they're keeping up as well as they are. So I'm a life flash before my eyes on that one. I keep looking down and seeing where they are compared to me. I need to stop doing that. I need to focus on the road and just do me. I mean, this car is pretty fast in the straights. It's not like it's slow. It's, just, it's not the optimal car for this, this type of race. Although I'd say we probably got the best route possible, because there have been a ton of big motion turns like this. Miles. See how fast that thing just kicks out, it flies, dude, this is nuts. Uh, boys, I think we got it. I think we got it with the dominant performance. The one thing I'm just surprised about is we started this race in first place. We never start the race in first place. You know what I mean? Like, we're always in last place and we have to work our way up. But I'll take that. We just got a, a win in a sprint race and uh, we're looking pretty good. Let's head back over to Robin and let's let's do one more drift race with her. See how, it, see how it plays out. Is that guy's name Boogerman? 
All right, so we're still on uh, we're still in the medium races with Robin. We need to get her up to hard. Ha! <laughs> Where we need to get hard with Robin. You guys catch my drift? No, all right. Um, so we gotta do that, and then we really we haven't done much with the outlaw guy, like the running the cops and stuff like that. Ooh, Manu was just calling us. I think. What was he calling us about? Can't answer it now. Or it might have been Amy actually. I think it was Amy's. It's probably Amy because we just beat her race. Oh, this is just a sprint race? Robin's usually all about the drifting, so... Kind of saw that coming, running into that pole right there. Bro. Wasn't ready for that one right there. All right, this is where we pull away from the pack. Just turning normally sends you into a drift. Let off the gas a little bit right there. It's getting a little hot. It's coming around corners at 170 miles an hour. Came into that one a little bit hot. We could have made that so much smoother, but that's our, we were going for high speed. And that, my friends, is going to be all she wrote. All right, there you guys have it. Ken Block's 1965 Hoonigan Mustang, the Hoonicorn. Absolutely sick. I'll see you guys in the next episode. We're going to take on some more Amy and Robin missions. Peace out.